Okay, refreshing the page after I've waited about 15 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and refresh the page. Scroll down. And there it is. You can see the Google AdSense ads right here showing right up on my blog. So it's up. It's working. Now, when anybody who visits my blog clicks on one of these ads, I'm going to make a few cents from Google AdSense. So pretty cool. You already have sponsors and advertisers for your blog without even having to go solicit them. All right. Now, if I want to make adjustments to this, what I want to do is go back into AdSense, log in, and now from the AdSense Setup tab, I want to click Manage Ads. And then when I scroll down here, I can see the ad that I created for DarrenBlue.com sidebar. And I can even adjust settings from this point right here that will show up on the AdSense on my blog. So I'm going to click Edit Settings. Here I can see the ID and the size. Now I, I can't change the size of the ad from back here. I would have to create a new ad if I wanted a bigger ad. Like for example, that's something I might do here because this is only filling up this narrow little space. If I wanted it to be wider, I could include two side by side here. So that's something I may want to consider. Also, I can jump back here and then edit the name of the ad, the text and images of the ad, and kind of the color scheme. So if you decided on a color scheme that's not quite what you were thinking about, then you can go back and change it here. Um, however, I'm just going to stick with what I have as is. Save settings. And then to really monitor this ad, I'm going to go click on reports. And then this will show me my channels. Right now I have a couple other AdSense ads going. So to see this one specifically and whether or not it's been clicked on, I'm going to select top channels and then scroll down and select view all AdSense content channels. Here's the one I want to view, the DarrenBlue.com sidebar. And let's go ahead and display report. I can scroll down here. And I can see I've only had one impression, so only one person has viewed my blog since I've added that AdSense ad to it. And it was probably me. Um, no clicks yet, no page click-throughs and basically no earnings yet. So you can monitor all that from right here. It tells you the statistics of your blog and you can tell if you're starting to make any money with your AdSense ads. I'm going to scroll back up here, go to the home page, and really that's all there is to Google AdSense. You can go ahead and create more ads if you want by going into AdSense setup again and then selecting Get Ads, and then AdSense for Content, and go through that whole process again if I want to create a bigger ad. However, if I'm okay with the size of the ad I started with, then just leave it there. And as you build up traffic and visitors to your blog, and you integrate your blog with your Facebook, your YouTube, and your sales funnel, then you're going to start making some income from these AdSense ads when people visit your blog and then click on them. And that's it for Google AdSense ads. Thanks for watching.